Hey everybody, it's Premier Gal here, and welcome back to my YouTube channel where I make all sorts of tech videos from video editing, video production, and reviews. And I am super excited because today Apple announced the new Apple iPhone X, which you can pre order October 27th, and it should ship out on November 3rd, and it's starting at $999. That seems like a lot, but wait until I tell you about the features. Now, before I dive into the features, I just want to let you know. I love Apple. I've been using their products for a very long time. I started working for them back in 2007 when I was in college. And ever since then, when I had my flip phone, I was like, I need to go to the iPhone. So I'm really excited for this new iPhone 10. Let's jump in to show you some of the features. So the first feature of the iPhone 10, which you will know once you look at it, is that there's no longer a home button. It's all a screen now, and the border between the edge and the screen barely even is there. It's 5.8 inches of pure screen, and it's a retina display with super durable glass. So the brain of the iPhone 10 is an A11 Bionic chip, and you're probably like, well, what the heck does that mean? Well, basically all you need to know is that it's the smartest chip that Apple has introduced to iPhones. And what it has done is it has enabled the ability, and I will talk about this a bit later, of augmented reality experiences, as well as it's part of a true depth system. And at the top of the iPhone, there are sensors and cameras that now, and wait for it, enable you to unlock your phone with your face. So basically the iPhone is mapping it out. You can now unlock your phone with your face, which is just incredible, right? And so that actually has an increased the chance of people unlocking your phone by one to one million. And before, with the thumb, it was one to 50,000. So now it's a heck of a lot safer. Also, with this new True Depth system, because of the face detection, you can pay using the Apple Pay with your face. So I would have never thought this, but you can pay with your face now, which is quite amazing. Also, you can use this new feature. It's no longer just emojis, but you can use the face identification to create animated emojis that act as puppets of your face. So if you want to send a fun message, an iMessage to a friend, um, and you can choose your puppet and say something and have your expressions, and it will mimic what you do. So this is just the beginning, and I'm so excited to see what comes in the next iPhone after this. So the third feature I want to talk about is the new cameras. So on the front, and I forgot to mention, as part of this true depth system, there is a new camera on the front that enables portrait mode. So for all of you guys that love doing selfies, but you really wanted that portrait mode look that was only available on the back, you can now get that amazing depth of field on the front. And now on the back, it has a dual image stabilization. One of the cameras is a 1.8 aperture and it's a wide angle lens. And the other one is 2.4 aperture and it's a telephoto lens. So combined together, you can really achieve some great images. And also, you can now shoot at 4K, 60 frames per second, and slow motion at 1080 HD at 240 frames per second. So you can really use this iPhone 10 as a video camera, and that is just amazing. Your smartphone as your camera, it's really changing things. Another great feature that I love and I'm so excited to test it out once I get it this fall is the new lighting system that comes within the iPhone 10 built in with the camera. So you no longer really have to worry about setting up the lights in any environment. You can change the lighting of your subject. It's real Apple magic, really. You can change it from stage lighting, uh, portrait lighting, contour lighting, and this is all with just literally a little swipe and a click. I'm so excited to test this out and I'm sure you guys are as well. The other great feature about the iPhone 10 is a new wireless charging system, which consists of just a mat that you place your iPhone on to charge it. I know that I'm sick of cables, so you don't have to worry about that anymore. In the iPhone mat, you can charge the iPhone 8 as well as the iPhone 10 and the AirPods on this charging mat, which you have to buy separately, but it's super cool. And 
lastly, but certainly not least, is the integration of augmented reality within the iPhone X. And I'm sure you've heard of it before, but AR, which is the shorter form of saying augmented reality, is literally overlaying a virtual world on top of the world that we live in. So it's literally just overlaying it rather than virtual reality, which is you're in a virtual world, right? So AR already exists with Snapchat or even Instagram stories. You overlay your face with a filter. You know, that's augmented reality. And now with the iPhone 10, you're gonna have more experiences coming with this. And Apple has been developing this for a while now, and this is their first product that is really showcasing it. So I'm really excited to get it in the fall and experiment with it. So thanks again, Apple, for helping us say hello to the future. And if you guys wanna get the iPhone 10, I'm going to be leaving a link in my description box as soon as the order link is available come in October. And if this video helped you out and helped explain things a little bit better, give it a thumbs up and please subscribe and also hit that notification bell so you are notified when I make new videos every week. Thanks again for watching guys and I'll see you all very soon. Bye.